All right, all right, all right, ladies, gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, welcome back to Sleeping Dogs. How you doing? I was just out trying to find health shrines and uh, doing a couple of security system hacks. You know, the little miscellaneous things around the map. But right now, we do have a mission to go speak to Winston. I think it's I think it's at the Golden Koi at least. As far as I can tell, or is no it's Club Bam Bam. Aya. Mommy Pop. Who's he talking to? It's the Dai Lo, man, it's the chairman. Wait, you're coming with me. Looks like you're gonna meet Uncle Po. The rest of you, wait here. Don't do anything until you hear from me. What's going on? You are staying here like I told you. And you are shutting the fuck up. Got it? Yeah, boss. Of course. Good. Well, something's got him Let's riled go. up. What's the percent chance we die today? <laughs> I worry. I pissed off the wrong people, away. Look, at least we kept Siwa alive. Yeah, that may be just what saves us. I'm gonna bump Uncle Poe's cut. But when that does it, it's not fair, you know? Look what I built. The night market. All of North Point, really. The dog eyes gets green. What was I supposed to do, Hanley Wabing Watanga? Just what you did. Look, you can't back down from that asshole. You and him got history, huh? Or well, me too. Yeah, quite a bit of history. Listen, and it seems like uh, it's not great. Anything, anything happens to me, you look after our people, okay? We're, we're a family. Family has to stick together. Duke. Conroy, they're good guys, but they're not going to be leaders. I know Conroy gives you shit, but you've proven yourself now. I know see it. Neither of you doesn't want to admit it. Well, do me a favor. Look after Peggy and my mom, too. This can be rough business. But one thing we got going for us is each other. Brothers, you know. I know people use that word. But it means something to me. And it should to you, too. Not just that we're son on ye. True brothers. Blood. We look after each other. And we look after the people we love. Okay, Winston. Yeah, I get See it. See why told me he really works for Big Smiley, not Dog Eyes. I keep hearing his name. Big Smiley is backing Dog Eyes, sure. That's where he gets the balls to come after me. Well, he has a lot of power. Along with drugs, he's in the prostitution. Porn. He even sells women across the border into the rest of Asia. Jesus. The whole thing is run like an industry. Very sleazy, but big money. Winston, we can't just walk in there. Not if it's as bad as you say. We don't have a lot of choice. It's the way it's done, Way. Besides, you can't hide from Uncle Poe. If you want you dead, you're dead. And I'd rather see it coming, you know? No, I get okay. that. But if I get my ass shot, do not do anything stupid, you hear me? Okay. Yeah, definitely want to face it head on rather than have it just slap you in the back of the head. Who gives a shit? Fuck off, Johnny. Hey, Winston. What's wrong? You look a little pale, man. That dog guy tells me you've been throwing your weight around. What happened? You guys used to be tight as shit. Is he here? Nah, he left a while ago. Without a scratch. Doesn't bode so well for the other parties involved. <laughs> Go right in. Have fun. This doesn't sound very good. Uncle Poe. Ah, Winston. Come in. Sit down. Have some tea. And you, young man, must be way. Winston speaks very highly of you. Winston has been a good friend to me. I've tried to do right by him. I like the way you think. 
That's the attitude that makes us strong. Loyalty, discretion. Used to be more common. Winston says you're the one who made sure Siwa was not arrested. No, it was Winston's idea. He had to assert himself, assert his position. But he didn't want to inconvenience you in the process. Did he now? In any case, you did well. I want to show you my gratitude. Uncle Pope, there's really no need. Don't argue with me. Do you know Roland Ho? He has a business collecting debts. Uh, the other day he told me that he could use some help. It's uh, quite lucrative, you know. <laughs> uh, tell him I sent you. Winston won't mind in the slightest, will you? Thank you, Uncle. Winston, 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 relax. I know you were provoked. That look of pure fear on his face throughout that entire time. Jesus. God damn it. I bet a thousand bucks I was going to be carrying you out in a fucking body bag. Uncle Poe must like you. Yeah, I don't think he has an opinion on me either way. All right. I tell you what, you get tired of spinning your wheels in the night market, give me a call. There's more to this business than strong arming street vendors. Ricky. Your name's Ricky, right? I appreciate the offer. You know, let me think about it and I'll get back to you. All right. Take Where the car we... across the street. Give you a chance to see what it's like to be in the big time. Oh, it's a nice car too. It's like one of those pseudo pseudo Audis that are in movies <laughs> or unbranded unbranded Audis. Yeah, you all right? Always am. Look, uh, in the meantime, I'm getting swamped with this wedding crap. I mean, need your help on a couple of things. Yeah? Yeah. I tell you, it's easier to be a Red Bull than a group. I'll stop by the restaurant when you're done there, okay? Got it. Sounds good. Couldn't even park inside. All right, Roland, I'm gonna talk to you in a moment. Let me uh, open this box. Just find random pieces of clothing in there. Hey, Roland Ho? Who's asking? My name's Wei Shen. Ah, oh, Wei, you got friends in high places, my boy. I hear you and Winston have been making trouble with Dog Eyes. Dog Eyes has been asking for trouble. <laughs> I remember when I was like you. Always looking for a fight. Ready to kill anyone who so much as looked at me sideways. Here's a tip for you, kid. Don't take on a boss in your own triad. Unless you know for a fact someone else is gonna back you up. Hierarchy is the only thing anyone cares about. Always have, always will. <laughs> Thanks for the advice, old timer. So, uh, when can we get to work? Okay, big man. What I didn't show. Petsy Wing. Bad luck at Mahjong. You'll need this. Collect what she owes. Fully automatic, huh? Some dumbass gambler is gonna have that much firepower? Right, let's go. Call from Jackie. What's up, Jackie? Hey, Jackie. Uh, just checking in, man. I heard things were kind of uh, intense. Wanted to make sure you're still with us, you know? Uncle Poe seems to have a handle on who's causing the trouble. <sighs> That's a relief. Look, I gotta go, Jackie. I gotta see a lady about some money. Uh, shit. You're gonna pay up, you understand? 
Really? That's a lot of muscle. Yeah, that's a lot of muscle. Come on. Good thing I got a gun. Thing, though. Got a car loaded with dope. All right, you don't have to do. Bring it back here as soon as you can. Don't drive around in a stash car any longer than you have to. Oh, I'm right here. That was crazy. Oh, this is an empire. Okay. Central apartment, high roller outfit. Let's go check out the apartment. After we meet with Raymond. Raymond. Shed, finally. Where the hell have you been? Look, I, uh, Do you have any idea what's going on? What happened at the warehouse? Raymond, do you ever actually read my reports? Your reports? All I have to do is read the goddamn newspapers. They're calling it a massacre. If it ever came out that the police were involved, we're dead. It won't. Well, you can't know that. You at least, you at least could have turned Siwa over to us. It would have helped our case. And would have put the entire operation at risk. What does Penju say? You know, he's not your handle, Wade. I am. Well, then fucking handle it, Raymond. Well, how'd you think this was gonna go down? Huh? Whatever it takes. You remember that? You wanted results, and you can't get them sitting behind a desk, nose in a rule book, with a stick up your ass. Look, Raymond, I am doing what needs to be done. No, no, you've crossed the line, Wade. I'm gonna terminate this operation. You can't do that. Pendrew won't allow it. Pendrew may like to take chances. I don't. And you are dangerous. Fine. But before you go back to your office to try and pull the plug, go ahead and tell Pendrew that I just met the chairman of the Sun on Yi. The chairman? <laughs> Wait, you're, 
You're just a foot soldier. Well, this foot soldier has just been marked for promotion because I made sure Suwa got out safely. It'll be in my report, and maybe this time you'll actually read it. I mean, if you're gonna question the operation, you gotta, you gotta get your facts straight. Oh, now. Pretty nice apartment. Okay, we got a couple of surveillance things to do. Uh, illegal fighting on a secret island? I've been, oh my god, it's one of the DLCs, isn't it? SWAT outfit, workout, disguise, police. Is that from Kill Bill? <laughs> it's great. I've never actually seen Kill Bill 2. That's funny, isn't it? Let's do a little bit of uh, surveillance. Okay, so he's probably it. Get him? We got them. We got them. Sounds good. Right, let's do one more because I think we had two. Also in North Point. Get some of that easy XP out of the way. Him too. We got them. We got them. All right, and that is our daily public service. <laughs> now to go back to killing people as a gang member. All right, out we go. There's a favor right across the street, so we can do that. Because why not? As long as we can get out from that bus. Oh, okay. Let's stick with red. This is probably the wrong way to go down this street, but fuck it. Is that Calvin? Oh dear God, dude, don't don't punch another cop. I'm leaving a few seconds. What is good driver? What do you need? What is it this time? Let's go. Follow Calvin. Okay. Oh shit! What the hell was that? Yeah, Get in, in the, the car! car last night. Well, I teach him a lesson. Some fucking lesson. Get in the Get car! Him. Bet he doesn't cheat again. Calvin! Get in the car, you idiot! Oh shit. Think you can lose him? You gonna pull this shit, you gotta learn to drive. Please us. learn to drive. Ah, 
jeez. the one driving crazy and you're the one who just shot up a convenience store for a shoplifter. Oh god, oh god, oh shit. I think you lost her. Hey, you could just let me off anyway. Get the hell out of my car. Speaking of cars, I saw a shop down here. I would like to buy a new one. Especially because this is beat to all shit. Oh my god, I'm covered in blood. Why? Why, Lang? This is one of a kind. Really one of a kind. Okay. So, wait, no, I can't buy that yet. Okay. What did you do? I'll just stick with this. You didn't just walk away from a deal like this. Shut up, dude. Alright, let's look at the map. Um There's another one back in central. And I think this is still the quicker way to get down here anyway. Back down to central, because Jesus Christ. Remind me to never pick up Calvin again. Like this game came out before Uber was more of a thing, but imagine him trying to call a goddamn Uber after doing some shit like that. He's basically using Wade as an Uber. With Crime. Crime Uber. Close now. Excuse me, bitch. Excuse me. Going up the center is the quickest way. Don't park there, dumbass. It's just so jarring. Look at that. What's the problem? I bought a whole shipment of birds in the mainland, but they keep losing. I think they must have been bringing them <laughs> or something. Well, that Might sucks. be nice to bet on them. Yes, exactly. I'm just about bankrupt. My only hope is to get the insurance money on the shipment and my truck. Your truck? If someone were to steal it and run into the harbor, I'd be safe. Damn. Chicken kanji. <laughs> So you want me to drown a truck full of chickens? Okay. I guess I'll do it. I have no choice to say no. This thing is already smoking. Don't want to hit anything that'll set it on fire. Excuse me. Then again, I don't think humans really count. Okay. We're good to go. Now all we need is a car. Okay, so what is the next mission? Uh, Bride-to-be. 
And what is the what is the case we have? Water Street. Which one is closer? Eh, screw it. Let's do the case. Why not? I like doing those cases. We just need a car now. Well, this works. Excuse me, in the name of the law, I'm confiscating your expensive vehicle. Bye. And then I'm going to proceed to drive on the wrong side of the road. This is not the fastest car. Why did I pick this car? The damn chicken truck was faster than this. Are you gonna take a wrong turn? Son of a bitch, okay. I really know how to fuck up a car, don't I? <laughs> for this, though. <laughs> At least it filled up my health. Is that cop looking to arrest me? <laughs> back through here. Of course I will. I bet you this game is going to have me running all over the city. Really, did? Couldn't have put on a blinker. Second. 
100% complete on the race. experience right to be is the next one. we're really gonna just pull up in this broken coop look at this at the restaurant. Or it should be, at least that's what he told us. Yeah, he mentioned it the other day. Congratulations. Uh,Peggy,呢,就是想准备一份礼。咁,佢又唔叫Winston,冇会问人车佢。啊,咁你,呃,唔介意啦吧?No uh, <laughs> problem at all, Mrs. Chu. Oh,咁就好啦。啊,走走啦。唔该晒。我要多啲鸡。你哋攞多啲鸡俾我啊。That <laughs> basically just boiled down to thanks, so fuck off. <laughs> that was great. I love her. Hello, Wei. Thanks for driving me around. Yeah, no problem. So, where are we going? The flower shop. I still have to pick the color I want. He won't believe how much work it is to get ready for a wedding. We've been planning for eight months now, and there's Damn. still so much to be done. I'm sure it'll be fine. Oh, uh, it better be perfect. My wedding has to be perfect. So, Wei, do you have a girlfriend? <laughs> no. My life, it wouldn't be a good idea right now. Your life is why it'd be good. You have to have someone you can be soft with too, right? It's very important. If you're hard all the time, one day you'll forget how to be soft. Then what will you be? <laughs> Don't scratch the paint! I do say so. You are family now, Way. I have to look out for you, just like Winston. After the wedding, I'm gonna find someone for you. So how do you get on with Winston's mother? Uh, she's a handful. But, you know, handful. her bark is worse than her bite. That I know. How about her meat cleaver? Ha! That's worse than her bark for sure. <laughs> now, she used to scare me, but then one day, I was having a problem with Winston. He wasn't paying enough attention to me, too distracted with work. And Mrs. Chu gave him a big lecture in front of the whole gang. I thought she might use that cleaver on him. Ever since then, Winston's been an absolute doll. And even though she still yells a lot, I know her heart is in the right place. Well, you're lucky. And my mother never liked my girlfriends. I guess it's hard for the moms. Well, I mean, you know, I used to have a thing for blondes, too. And that drove her crazy. Bad <laughs> enough if I went out with a Chinese-American girl, but, but a whitey? <laughs> well, it's good to know she was loyal to her people. No, she's loyal to her prejudices, more like. That, too? Yeah, most definitely. <laughs> I'm pretty sure my mother wouldn't have a problem with it. More than pretty sure, I know she would. I'm here to finalize the details of the flower arrangement. <laughs> yes, yes. 
I'm just the driver. <laughs> I am not in this wedding. I'm just gonna change back and then we'll be done. Uh, actually, there is one other thing. Black orchids. This probably sounds silly, but it was my mother's favorite flower. And now that she's gone, I was thinking that I'd love to have a black orchid centerpiece. I'm afraid that's impossible. <laughs> there are none to be found in Hong Kong. Really? Well, I thought they had some down at the Garden Temple. Well, yes, but they're not for sale. The other day, the CEO of Old Boy Trading wanted one for his daughter. He told him they offered Temple $100,000. They still say no. <laughs> it's incredible, no? <laughs> A black orchid at a wedding guarantees that the couple stays together for the rest of their lives. Oh well, Way, come on. We can go now. We'll figure it out. All right, next we need to pick up the wedding cake. So you got a cake picked out? Winston's in charge of that. He knows I'm very particular about cakes, but he promised I wouldn't be disappointed. I'm sure Winston will impress me. It's our wedding after all. <laughs> and your wedding has to be perfect. Now you're getting it. <laughs> I'm sure he will. He loves you very much. Oh, shit. So your mother took you to the States? <sighs> yeah, you know, she loved Hong Kong, but she wanted to give me and my sister a change of scenery. Oh, were you being a bad little boy? <laughs> no, it, it was Mimi, my sister. Growing up in Old Prosperity, she, you know, she started down a particular road and couldn't get off of it. And my mother hoped that moving to San Francisco would shake her up, change who she hung out with, you know? Did it? Yeah, for a while. But some habits die hard, you know? Some don't die at all. I'm sorry, Wei. Winston mentioned that she Look passed that. away. I didn't mean to bring it up. Uh, it's okay, baby. Hey, you know, isn't it's that a band from the wedding cake company? From and where you're going. Hang on. What are you doing? Uh, yeah, the guy, the guy had the wrong address. Winston asked me to make sure the cake is delivered. He's so thoughtful. Wait, slow down! <sighs> Peggy, if we don't catch that van, you won't have your special cake at your wedding. What? Fast, fast, go fast! <laughs> Immediately, go over. fast! You're a gangster, do something! Get out there and get him! Alright, I got you. Might want to take the wheel at one point, though. Jesus, we're going at top speeds. Look at that. And it's still faster than us. Here. Here, take the wheel. Careful, don't hurt my cake. Don't worry. Get that van. Go, go. I'm on it, Peggy. Calm down. You can do it. Ah, get up. I'll follow you. Oh god. Wait, what the hell? There we go. Aye! Okay, we dropped this off with the bus depot for some reason. Just up ahead. Don't want to fuck up the cake so let's not crash into anything. Tell Winston I got the cake. Wow, that's great. I'll take it right to him. All, right, All done. Oh, thank you, Way. Thank you. You know, it makes me think. <laughs> the wedding just won't be perfect without that orchid. We're going to the temple, aren't we? I knew you'd understand. <laughs> I figured we'd be going that way. Do you have any family here at all? Uh, no, not anymore. Well, you're wrong, Way. You have family, you have us. Thanks. No, I mean it. I know Winston's work can be... rough, but it makes us a family, too. Yeah, no, I, 
appreciate it. Man needs brothers, uncles, and sisters too. To help me with that soft side. Don't laugh, it's very important. You know, I could probably set you up if you want. <laughs> You're a good looking man. <laughs> Thank Thanks, you. but but I'm not looking for anything serious right now. I wouldn't want it to reflect poorly on you. Ah, uh, uh-huh. You're still playing around, huh? Well, let me know if you ever change your mind. I know some nice girls. We'll do that, Peggy. Anybody who associates with her seems pretty nice anyway. Right back. Right up we go. After hours it is. But shit, go in the door. What are you doing here? <clears throat> when it when energy flows among flowers, we are all everywhere. I am here and not here. I um, love flowers. <laughs> ah, brother. So true, so true. That's just the thickest layer of bullshit I've ever seen. You don't belong here. Uh, what is belonging, brother, when we're all part of the same cosmos? I guess failure is impossible. Again. Thickest layer of bullshit. And time for the third and final layer of bullshit. Hey, who are you? Well, who is anyone? When we are all each other, part of a single great organism that never dies. Ah, brother. So true, so true. Okay. Now for these orchids. That's nice, they're glowing too. You stop right now! Ow! I mean, I guess that's what I get for fighting Shelvin Monks! Right over here. Okay, let's get out of here. There it is! Over here! Oh shit. Ow, okay, sorry. I apologize. Ooh. Okay, come on. I need one of you to, to attack. Forward. There you go. Okay, we just drowned a man. <laughs> I'm the armor. Oh, they're are they all gone? The ones over here are. Let's take this because I saw you. Let's get the fuck out of here. These two can be dirty every time. Hey, Becky, I'm back. You got them? Oh, wait, thank you so much. How can I say no? 
Peggy, do you have any Winston's clothes in the back? <laughs> I don't think these robes are gonna make the right impression. What do you think about this? <laughs> yeah, sure. Oh, uh, Winston is not gonna like this. It's okay, it's okay. Go, go! What do you think I'm doing, Peg? Out of, out of it. Wait, what are you doing? Getting us in the clear. Oh, thank you, Wei. Thank you. It was my pleasure. And if you're gonna be my sister, the least I can do is help out with your wedding. Your mother would be proud of you. I hope so. Now, sometimes I wonder. No, I can see it. Life isn't perfect, it never is. But you have a good heart. Peggy, I. Nope, I know. Women's intuition. It's the same with Winston. He talks tough, but underneath, he's a very caring man. That's why I love him. Thanks. That's the secret. You do what you have to do, but you always remember your family. Remember the people who love you. Then you'll always be happy. Some good advice. Thanks for being so helpful, Way. I really appreciate it. Of course. It. Sometimes this wedding thing stresses me out. There's so much to get right, and you only get one try. Don't worry, Peggy. It's gonna be perfect. Oh, it's so nice to find someone you can really rely on. I can see why Winston likes you. Thanks. You'll be fine. Everything's gonna be fine. Okay. I guess we can just take the car. Come on. I won't pay that much for anything. Uh, oh wow, the wedding is the very next mission. Okay. Um We got two girls on our phone. So I think when we return in like a minute or two, we're gonna take her up on that offer. So, thank you so much for watching, and I will be back in a moment.